Hey guys, Darth 970 again, and welcome to the first video of the new year. So, Happy New Year to all of you, hope you had a good one, and I'm also sorry this is a day too late. But, let's get on with it. Uh, for starters, my top 3 Gunpla predictions for this year. Number 1 is, without a single doubt in my mind, going to be the High Great Universal Sentry, Zaku 2, High Mobility Type, R2, Johnny Ryden version. Whew, that's a mouthful. But without a single doubt in my mind, they've, uh, the Black Tricyce version is going to be released in February. They've already announced the Shin Matsunaga version. So without a doubt, Johnny Ryden is going to be next. Number two, once again, without a single doubt in my mind, the real great Strike Freedom Gundam. They've uh, already announced the Destiny Gundam. Not sure when it's going to be released, but sometime this year. So, yeah, I'm actually willing to bet that it's not just going to be released this year, but it's actually going to be the next real grade, without a doubt. Number three, well, this is a bit more of a guess, but we're going to have the uh, Destiny Remaster this year. So, well, I'm hoping for the Daggers to finally get their high grades released. But yeah, um, to make it a bit more plausible, I'm going to bet that the third... Well, on place three is going to be the Windam. Uh, simply because, well, Mula Flaga slash Neo Roanoke pilots one. So, and they're also two colors. So, if they make one of them, they can make the other one. And they get twice the amount of sale value. So, those are my three for this year. Oh, and, well, I'm just gonna throw in, like, a, an extra a wild card, because I really hope that they're going to release a Master Grade Leo. Come on, we finally need a model kit of the Leo. And I'm not talking about that limited model. Not at all. We need a real one. An affordable one, and a good one. Seriously, make it happen, Bandai. You gave us a Master Grade Tall Geese. We want a Leo. So, those are my Gumpla predictions. On to my New Year's resolutions. And if you've seen my past video, they're kind of going to be the same because they didn't all work out all that great. Resolution number one. Once again, watch all Gundam series. I still have to watch Gundam H, not looking forward to that. G Savior, not looking forward to that at all. If you don't know what a G Savior is, be happy, don't look it up, and just keep doing what you're doing. Uh, number three, turn a Gundam. I don't know what to expect. Um, generally, people who have seen it say that it's the best Gundam series ever, but I have seen some scenes that make me question the series. I'm not gonna judge it yet, I'll see it when I've watched it. And finally, I'm finally gonna have to finish Victory Gundam. I'm about halfway, and then I can, and then I'm finished. But it's not just a Gundam problem, I haven't watched a lot of anime in the past year at all, actually. So I'm definitely gonna watch more anime this year. Resolution number two, collect all the gems. That's probably going to be the easiest one, because I only need the Gym uh, Cannon 2. Resolution number 3, collect all Mayrin figurines. Probably going to be a bit harder, because they're quite hard to find. But, I'm gonna do my best. Resolution number 4, uh, try... Well, this year I'm going to try to make at least one custom, and one custom paint job. I've been working on both for quite a while now, like, I, like I've already said a few times, I've been working on custom gems forever for now. And yeah, I really finally want to finish some, seriously. And yeah, I can show them to you guys then. Resolution number five. I'm going to try to make at least one video each week. Like I said last year, it wasn't always the case, so, well, starting uh, January the 16th, that's when my exams end. I'm going to try to make at least one video each week. Resolution number six. We're almost there. It's going to be a surprise. Um, but it suffices to say that it's something no other Gumpla reviewer has ever done before, as far as I know. And it will show you just how much I love the gym. Resolution number seven. Uh, the last one. And kind of out of the blue. 
I'm finally going to try to catch all 151 Pokemon. I've been trying to catch these critters for 14 years now, or 15 already, I think, and I'm finally going to try to catch them. And now that we're talking about Pokemon, my general, well, general impression for the next, well, for this year. Well, this year is going to be one hell of a retro year for me uh, in both Gunpla, um, anime, and games. Like I said, retro gaming doesn't get more retro than Pokemon, or Zelda, I guess. And um, for Gunpla, HLJ is going to get a lot of restocks of old Gunpla. As I've already placed an order for uh, the F91 models, they're re-releasing the antique 160 scale models. I definitely want to pick those up. So, well, you can expect a lot of old Gunpla and, well, also a lot of the antique ones, such as the Magellan here, which I've pretty much completed. I just have to paint his um, main engines here. Oops. So, yeah, expect more of that kind of stuff this year. And I'm also going to try to watch more of the retro 80s animes. Currently, I'm watching Elgheim. So you can also expect some reviews of Elgheim models, which I'm probably going to pick up because I've seen that they are pretty cheap on eBay, and HLJ also has some of them that are still in stock for quite low price. So my overall impression for this year is going to be pretty damn retro, and I'm really looking forward to it because there are a lot of great 80s real robot series. I'm really looking forward to watching them all, such as the Dragonar series, Elgheim, Votoms, Mospeda, and so on and so forth. So, like I said, you can expect a lot more of those retro reviews in this coming year. Um, well, I guess give your opinion down below. If you don't want them, just say it and I won't do as much. If you really, really want those, also post it down below and I'll try to do more of those reviews. Of course, I'm also going to try to um, keep up with the latest models such as the Nemo that's getting released, the Jesta Cannon. Not sure about that one yet, depends on how much you're going to release at that time, but I'm definitely going to catch up with the Nemo, the Black Tristar, Saku. Well, I'm looking forward to a great year, I hope you guys are too, and see you at the next video.